Hi, I'm Mike, and this is Mike's Road Trip. Get off the road! All right. Hey guys, well, I have traveled long and far for this next trip. I'm in the Nordic country of Finland, where in a few days, I'm going to participate in a Winter on Wheels event in the northern part of the country. But right now, I'm in the vibrant city of Helsinki, located right on the Baltic Sea. This is the nation's capital. So come along with me. Let me show you around. After a long journey from the west coast, my first priority was to get some rest. The next morning I strolled the cobblestone streets of Helsinki to get my bearings, while seeing some interesting and talented street performers. I then took a short ferry ride across the harbor to the Sumanlina Sea Fortress, one of the most popular sites in Helsinki. Here, visitors can explore historic buildings while finding solace from the hustle and bustle of town. Back in town, you'll find plenty of outdoor activities, architecture, and Epicurean delights. Well, now I'm in the Lapland area, staying in the regional capital of Rovaniemi, where the winter activities thrill and the holiday spirit, well, it never ends. Rovaniemi is located in the Arctic Circle and is the official headquarters to the real Santa Claus, where I got a chance to meet the man himself. This is the official post office for Santa Claus, where over a half a million children from around the world send their Christmas wishes. Santa Claus Village is a magical place with lots of things to see and do. Even the hotel I stayed at is named for old St. Nick. Tonight I'm having dinner in an igloo at a place called Snowland. I had a host of winter activities in my bucket list, and the folks from Lapland Safaris allowed me to check off most of them. So right now we're participating in the rally sport. scratch another one off the bucket list. After a break to warm up by a fire, we then had an opportunity to go dog sledding and then ride in a reindeer sleigh before hopping back on our snowmobiles toward our destination. As night fell, we relaxed in a sauna and invigorated ourselves with a dip in the frozen river. Then. It was time to dine by fire in a relaxing lodge to conclude the evening. The next day, it was all about culture with a visit to the Arctica Museum. That evening, we enjoyed some local fine dining cuisine. The adventures in Rovaniemi never seemed to end. The next day, I went snowshoeing, tobogganing, and even got to see some great snow athletes. Well, now I have traveled south from Rovaniemi to the seaside town of Kemi, which is home to this extraordinary ice castle. Visiting the snow castle was such a unique experience, and yes, I even stayed the night. The next day I took an Oloko ride 
and then boarded the only tourist icebreaker cruise in the world. Of course, the grand finale of visiting Lapland, Finland were the Northern Lights. Well, that's it from my extraordinary trip to Finland. Till next time, we'll see you on the road.